that Bangladesh could indeed become a developed country by 2041. Bangladesh has set specific goals, including these. Reaching the rank of a middle-income country in 2021. And achieving comprehensive development goals by 2030. Then it will turn into a developed country by 2041. And achieving the status of the miracle state in 2071. Then implement Plan Delta by 2100. In this video, we will show you the biggest current and future projects of Bangladesh. But first, do not forget to share the video, interact with the channel, and subscribe to the channel. The Robor nuclear power plant is currently under construction. Parallel to two VER 1200 reactors, with a total capacity of 2400 megawatts. Nuclear energy is one of the sources of electricity that many countries of the world have resorted to. It is the largest source of electricity in the world after thermal, hydro and renewable sources of electric energy. The Robor nuclear plant will be located on the eastern bank of the Ganges. It is about 160 kilometers from the capital, Dhaka. This plant consists of two nuclear power units. It is equipped with two VER reactors with a capacity of 1,200 megawatts each. The first power unit is scheduled to be launched in 2022 and a second power unit in 2023. The energy sector in Bangladesh is one of the fastest growing energy sectors in South Asia. The factory will be built in Bangladesh, a power's largest natural gas to energy project and its first projects in the energy market in Bangladesh. The project is to build a natural gas power plant in Bangladesh. Gas-fired independent power plants with a capacity of 3,600 megawatts are under development, with an investment of $2.5 million. This contributes to meeting the increasing demand for energy in the country. The project will contain a dedicated LNG to gas regasification facility with an investment of $500 million. The project location will be in Mashakali or any other alternative location as determined by the feasibility study. Bangladesh plans to increase electricity from renewable energy projects. And it will reach 40% by 2040, to meet the demand of its citizens for electricity. The cost of the first phase is estimated at $16 million. The project is scheduled to be implemented in three phases at a total cost of $40 million. The first phase of the 40 MW rooftop solar project was opened earlier. Bangladesh has so far completed about 40 green energy projects. On an area of 6.5 million square feet. Qatar plans to invest $5 billion in Bangladesh over the next few years. Doha has launched many projects within different sectors in the capital, Dhaka or other cities. He referred to the most important areas concerned with Qatari funds, and put energy at the forefront of its priorities. In addition to transportation, infrastructure, industry and agriculture. Bangladesh is the border hub that allows goods produced on its territory to reach other countries through its land borders, or by shipping it by air and sea and exporting it to countries wishing to import it. In addition to the distinctive quality of agricultural land in Bangladesh, the availability of manpower with reasonable salaries will make it one of the most prominent Qatari investment destinations during the next phase. The project will improve connectivity between the capital, Dhaka, and the southwestern provinces, in a way that supports major economic activities including agriculture and fishing, in terms of reducing travel time and costs and allowing agricultural products to reach markets faster. The bridge is 1.3 kilometers long. It costs $75 million. This complex consists of a mixed-use commercial building. It consists of 20 floors and a computer shopping complex of 4 floors. It is located on a plot of 2 acres. This project aims to generate regular income. 
in order to finance and implement various projects in the fields of education and human resource development, and strengthening institutions in Bangladesh to provide financial assistance to Muslim students, Islamic educational institutions and orphanages in Bangladesh. The goal was to gradually transform a large population into a productive workforce. By enhancing its technical ability to use current and emerging technologies that lead to sustainable and equitable economic growth. The estimated cost of the project is 85.5 million US dollars. It is a two-story road and a railway bridge. The Padma Bridge is a major project under the Belt and Road Initiative. The bridge is 6.15 kilometers long and will be completed primarily in 2022. The Padma Bridge is of far-reaching importance for economic development. In the relations between South Asia, Bangladesh, and China, it is expected to contribute 1.2% annual GDP growth of districts in southwestern Bangladesh. It will boost economic development in the region. The first phase of the Mongla port dredging project was completed ahead of schedule. The second phase of this port has begun. The total length of the dredging channel for the port's second phase project is about 24 kilometers. The total volume of the shelf is expected to exceed 20 million cubic meters. After implementing the project, the main channel of the Mongla port will be able to accommodate more large merchant ships entering and leaving the port which is of great importance, to enhance the port's production capacity and promote economic prosperity and development in southwest Bangladesh. Recently, the Madhubari Deep Water Port project in Bangladesh was approved. It is the first deep water port project. It was invested by the country's economic commission. The project is located in the Cocos Bazar area. It is the first deep water port project in Bangladesh, with a total investment of $2.133 billion. It is expected to be completed by 2026. In your opinion, which of these projects is the best in Bangladesh? And here we come to the end of the video. Do not forget to share the video, interact with the channel, and subscribe to the channel.